Hello everyone, Elite Cameraman here. Just like yesterday, I have some bad news and it's actually worse. If you have watched my video yesterday, you would know that Dafuk has been striked twice, and episode 67 part 2 was almost delayed, and if he actually wanted to post it 10 hours later, it would have been delayed 10 days. Which is crazy to think about because a few hours ago, Dafuk made an announcement on his Discord server saying that he has received the third strike. He stated, You've all probably heard about my channel receiving two copyright strikes. These strikes didn't come from owner of any materials I used, even though second strike came allegedly from owner of speaker models. But this turned out to be a lie, and the original creator isn't involved in any of this at all. These strikes came from the people who make Gary's mod characters battle videos on YouTube, such as Heart G Mod. And it goes on to explain how they operate, but I won't read every MSG, instead I'll put them on the screen and you can read them by pausing the video if you want. After this, he sent some screenshots of the strikes and said, From what I've known, one anonymous telegram group have gathered all those who hate my content and gave them tips on how to successfully falsely strike my channel. And continued on to explain how the situation started with him and Dom Studios striking these channels and now Heart G Mod is apparently blackmailing Dafuk and holding his account as hostage, and they also apparently said that these strikes will continue even if his channels get terminated. Dafuk also said that his talks with YouTube all resulted in corporate responses, which means it's most likely automated responses or responses from people that can't do anything about the situation. And this is actually something you can help with because whenever situations like this arise, big creators go on to Twitter, which is called X, now I know, and tweet about the situation resulting in the issue to be fixed a lot faster than it normally would. Dafuk also tweeted on Twitter on his brand new account for the first time ever, just for this. I'll put the link to this tweet in the description and the comments, so make sure to go to this tweet, like it, and retweet it. If you don't have an account, open one and do it afterwards because this is the best way you can help since we need YouTube's attention because the strikers are saying that they'll keep doing it even if they are terminated. One thing I would also do is to at Moist Critical and Ludwig under the tweet because they both cover drama like this all the time and it might actually help the situation. If we don't fix this and get YouTube's attention, Dafuk at least won't be able to post a new video for about 10 days, and that's only if all the strikes are resolved. If the strikers keep striking, he might not be able to post for even longer. His channel is also at risk of termination, but I don't think that it'll go there because these are clearly false strikes. Once you see what the third strike is, for which I'll show in a second, you'll be speechless. Five minutes after writing all his announcement messages, Dafuk sent another message saying that he just received his third strike, and it's actually from someone else. But the reason for the strike is so laughable, and I have no idea how YouTube is letting this be. This strike was on episode 59 of Skibidi Toilet, and it was issued by someone called Yeoman's Mom, another G-Mod Skibidi Battle YouTuber. I'm not going to show you any of his videos, but this blood claimed that he made Speaker Man before Dafuk Boom. He sent one of his two-month-old videos as proof, while Dafuk made the first Speaker Man like six months ago, and these strikes are supposed to be reviewed by YouTube before going through. This is basically bullshit, to be honest. Abusing the system like this should not be allowed. Forget the strikers, people are never going to change and false strikes will always be a thing, but YouTube needs to take action and actually review these strikes just a little before issuing them. It shouldn't take more than five minutes for a 10-year-old to understand these guys didn't make Speaker Man. Dafuk also commented on the video that was used as the strike's so-called proof, saying, this video was used to strike me SMH. Right now, even if Dafuk wanted to upload a video, he wouldn't be able to, and if these issues are not solved, episode 68 or episode 67 part 3 will need to be delayed. I personally think it's going to be part 3 because it was a huge cliffhanger. From what it looks like, Dafuk was planning to post every 7 days, and that plan is ruined now, and if these issues are not fixed, the damage will be done. So as I said earlier, go on Twitter, his account is called DafukBoom underscore legit, and like and retweet all his tweets. Because on his Twitter he shared a screenshot of a message from the strikers and explained the Russian text. Apparently the strikers are planning to keep his channel inactive and he has three strikes forever so that he never uploads again. If this happens, we would be left on episode 67 part two forever, unless you go and help. My videos get about 500,000 views usually, 
And even if only 100,000 of you goes on to like his tweet, I think we'd reach a big enough audience to get YouTubes and other YouTubers' attention. If you care and enjoy the series, go and go do your duty and like the tweets. Elite Cameraman out.